Hi guys, uh, it's Johnny from Kalpani Games. Today I'm gonna show you a nice software called Dragon Bones. It helps you to make a much more faster animation for your 2D games using skeletal rigs and uh, some other features that it has. And I'm also gonna show you how to import the already made animation to Unity in a very easy way. So it will save you a lot of time and you don't have to make those frame by frame and make uh, hundreds of uh, hand-drawn uh, sprites to make your animation so let's start so first of all you're gonna go to this dragon bones website and click on download and download to your respective windows or operating system i have i'm using windows i downloaded this and i have started this uh, in the dragon bones uh, which i already installed i'm using a an animation provided by them a sheep and uh, over here and to export it to unity what we do this is export then we just leave them as the default settings make sure you select the data and texture then you click finish which i have already done and i have saved those in this folder next thing you want to do is uh, go to unity and uh, import custom package and dragon bones for unity and this uh, custom package can be found from this website from github which i will link in my description below and then after you import you'll get this folder so next thing you need to do is uh, grab these three files and put it on any folder you like and put it here after you've done that we're gonna create right click on the skeletal ship and skeletal over here or whatever how you have named it then create dragon bones armature object which will give you this and your animation is pretty much uh, ready if you play this you can do like that see it's already ready now you must be wondering how to use this animation by code or trigger with events or key presses I will show you that within a second I have made a script called move test which I have in here I'll open it up over here I have using visual studio code to, and then the main thing difference of between having a regular movement script and this one so over here you must include this statement called uh, using dragon bones then you make your own logic for your movement script then uh, you must include this statement to access the their animation uh, components in unity so you say private uh, unity armature component then uh, you name whatever you like for me over here is player right now then we go in the, in the set in the voice start we get that component after that you just do it as uh, normally you would do you to move and to detect key press you just do input get key whatever key you want and change uh, play like player dot animation dot play and play a name the whichever animation and the name of the animation you want to play and that's it so i will show you in that in action over here if i play if i play a i do this it changes the animation press d it changes to walk which i have what i have set in my code so i hope that's helpful to you and uh, yeah dragon bone saves you a lot of time and uh, saves you a lot of effort so you can consider on programming and other aspects of game development instead so thank you for watching have a good day see you next time